Okay. He didn't pick out the green thing. Okay. He did see it and approve of it. And also she likes green. Oh. If you must know. Okay. Like screen. Wow, I did not have Boston cream donuts. It's pretty spicy, man. I don't know if I'd want to put Pete in there. You would? Toss up. Wow, gas here is 218, right? Wait till you see what it is in Jersey. I seen it close to a dollar, 90 something. Hmm. Diesel, I seen for 276. Dude. I never thought I'd see that again. How old was gas when you first started driving? Like, how, how, how much? When, how old were you when you noticed what it was? Well, you know, when you started driving, how, everybody remembers it. What, what was it? I don't know, probably a dollar forty. Dollar forty. I don't know, man. I remember as a little kid something about Jimmy Carter and um, we would there was like rationing and we we'd buy our, we'd buy gas and put it in a tank at the house. Yeah. Um, for like I don't know why, but we would store like thirty or forty gallons of fuel because that was because it was rationed and I remember that, sort of. My god am I old. That's back in the late seventies, mid seventies, wasn't it? What's it like to be older than I am? It can be good. I don't know. Don't spill your soup. No, it ain't. Age is... Age hurts. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Fuck. Well, all right. I remember gas when it was 32 cents a gallon. When I first started driving. Fred Flintstone over here. And that was when I got my license in 1973. There wasn't 72. Yeah, somewhere in there. 72, 73. Yeah. Must have been 72, because I got my car at 73. That I still have. Alright, well I'm gonna I'm gonna eat and drive. Alright, I guess I should put my seatbelt on because you're a little bit of an aggressive driver. I am. You look where you're living, you gotta be. You gotta live aggressive, Mike. We don't live in uh um, you know Lincoln, Nebraska. Check it out. My New Year's, I got some New Year's resolutions, man. There's seven million people in Philadelphia. You better drive I'm gonna, like you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to be less aggressive this year, right? <laughs> right? Driving wise? Just in general. Okay. I'm gonna so you're telling me I'm aggressive? What the hell's that? I'm gonna, I'm gonna smile more, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to not piss people off. Okay. To. <laughs> <laughs> I probably won't keep that one. Yeah. Um, did I say smile more? I'm going to try to smile more. Yeah, right? you said that. I didn't smile a whole lot last year. Okay. And I'm dripping soup all over my... Well, it's on the side of the cup. You got to... God damn it. I have done nothing wrong, and my soup is not behaving. You're a mess. Anyway. We ain't even on the highway. Wait, what are you going to do when you get on the highway? Wear it all. Drive all right, so you don't wear too much. See, I'm going to be nice to people this year. Okay. 
Okay. Or maybe not. So New Year's resolution, is this what you're saying? Yeah. Okay. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do different this year? How about let's make some money? Yeah, I've been making money. Defensive Driving Academy, I like it. We could compete with them with offensive driving. Register and try our 30 hour course for free! Three exclamation points. Try our 30 hour course for free. Not the whole 30 hour course though. Right. You get three minutes. Or however long it takes them to sell you the driving course. It's a phone interview. Nice. <laughs> it's free. It's free though. Hell, they might even call me for free. <laughs> what did I do to that, whoever that was the other day, Ray? I had you on the phone and I, the other phone was ringing. I answered it. Uh, and I told yeah. a guy to bring his check. Oh, he wanted to, he wanted to help us with our Facebook advertising. Yeah. So I said, well, I'll tell you what. Bring your checkbook over here, write me a check, and we'll be I'll be happy to talk with you about it. Get off my fucking phone. There went my New Year's resolution, yeah, Ray. I fucked it up already. 30 seconds into it, it's all gone. <laughs> yeah, that was something. Yeah, well, the phone guys, you don't get too many of them anymore. You know, I'll be right in the middle of doing something. And there that phone is. and that Wait. phone will ring, and it's the business it line, and I'm like, okay, you know. Mess me all up. If it ain't that one, it's my personal phone, because that's my business phone, too. Yeah. I don't have a personal phone either, Mike. What is this you ask? It's the Conchester Highway. Anybody that lives in the area knows this road and what it does. It's Conchester. Uh, it creates a traffic jam. It is commonly referred to as the Killer Conchester. There's probably more deaths on this road than 95. Really? Oh yeah. This is low key today, it's a weekend, but you come down through here on the weekday I've been on this road twice this week so far, during the week, and, uh, yeah. You better watch the road. All right, I'm gonna click off on this thing. All right. Uh, just so we save enough room on the camera, I only brought one with us. Uh, to, uh, to look at the gridiron, yeah. All right. So, 